Hi guys, welcome back to CG Productions. My name is Tom. And my name is Paul. Patreon campaign. First game of season two. Yes. Uh, season two doesn't have many matches. I realised this in doing the. It's got my favourite team. Maybe. Like once in it. Twice actually, I suppose. Three Twice. times. The bear. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so, in today's one, who are we playing for? Uh, I am playing the Alchemists. And I'm playing the Engineers. And we're playing a four. Four. Fair. Four player teams. Same. Um, um, yeah, so basically yeah. in the story, this is the one where a lot happens actually, but there's only four main players on each side. Mm -hmm. So, we've got a uh, multitude of things. Velocity gets crushed by Calculus, Calculus gets attemptedly drowned in a puddle by Salvo, oh. and then... And then the big man arrives, veteran catalyst. Yeah, well, Venom's poison kicks in, doesn't Yeah, it? so the, the, the story, if I remember correctly, Venom is new to the, the Alchemist so guild. To and, do a bit of and an and, uh, job. Yeah, and kind of want to, do you want to get rid of Midas, don't they? Yeah. Uh, so, do you kind of use Catalyst as a... As a way of kind of causing discord. Yeah, and uh, yeah and didn't Midas like blow up a village as well in season two? Isn't yeah. that like one of the issues? I might be making that up, but I think he also blew up like a village, which is why Sonic gets know. I think actually Venom, Venom's just testing out his, his poisons. I think he's I been think paid. That's what it is. I've, I've reread it this. I think he's been paid oh. by an outside guild informer. But anyway, the way it's going to work is, like I said, Cage Ball, we're bringing back even though it's dead. We are bringing it back, but we're not using mascots because none were named. So we've got four players mm -hmm. on four in that tightly confined pitch. Where I'm terrified the of Vet Cat. Uh, Paul can start with normal Catalyst yeah. and he can trigger Vet Cat whenever he feels like it. Anytime. At I any time like, at boom. all. Boom, Vet Cat surprise, yeah. which is terrifying because then that Furious and Twitch melee. A one inch melee and a good pusher suddenly becomes, I'm going to eat your face off. I think people are going to get thrown off the board. Yeah. I think people are going to get chunk miles. Um, vet Cat. You... Deadbolt at a distance. Yeah, and there's Colossus with an expected arrival. Yeah. Um, when Vet Cat does pop up, he will retain any status conditions for the fire. Or any um, damage he's taken. And any damage that normal Cat take will be minus off the top of Vet Cat's yeah. damage, if that makes a good look to me editing this. Um, <laughs> But yeah, really looking forward to it. We've wanted to do Cage Ball for a while, as we've mentioned several times. Yeah, we're thinking of making it the main focus on the on the channel rather than the, the Guild Ball match reports. Obviously, we'll still still do a couple of your quick and dirty few guys. We'll still we want to see how this goes, to be honest. But it's also because we know the next season match is huge. It's the Hunters versus the Morts. It's two control teams against each other. Yes. Where the bear eats gas. Eat gas. So this should be two footballing teams going at it in a confined space. Yes. A lot of damage, a lot of goals. Hopefully. Hopefully yeah. First ten, not eight, because we don't want to screw you out of a short video. Yeah. Basically, because yeah. you used to be at eight. So first to ten points mm -hmm. uh, to get going. So we'll go look at the teams and we'll see you in a sec. And this is my lineup for this kind of small cage ball y showdown pool. I think, well, let's go through it anyway. We've got Colossus, big Colossus, which on a small pitch, Colossus is quite the presence with his unexpected the rival. At, um, anyway, isn't he? Yeah, we've got Ballista and Salvo for kind of a bit of range control, hopefully, kind of keeping the scary, scary catalyst at bay. And then Velocity, who's going to have ridiculous opportunities, I think, to get in on goal with a slightly narrow pitch. Yeah. She's a. Uh, a hefty goal scoring machine mm -hmm. um, but essentially if Salvo can drown Calculus in a puddle like it does in the story we need a puddle to <laughs> we need a puddle we need some like wet terrain just kind of in front um, but yeah that's my lineup, and we'll go over to the Alkies next so for me I've got um, the big man Catalyst and, and the, the, bigger bigger, man. <laughs> the bigger man Catalyst obviously uh, I, di I didn't even notice this when I was painting obviously whatever um, Venom put in has changed his hair colour changed his hair colour <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah totally I was, I was thinking of Vitriol while I was painting him and I was like yeah yeah ginger hair that, that, that's right and is there any plan yet of when to unleash the beast or um, is it just going to be it's going to be early yeah because he's got it's, it, just, really. it's just absolute tank on this thin pitch I'm terrified because <laughs> he can charge anything pretty much yeah he's got an 8 inch range hasn't he so he's, he's getting around like if he's dead centre of the board Super Striker Midas. Super Striker Midas, Captain Captain Supreme. He um, was okay in our last one that we did for the season one. Match. No, he wasn't. He just kind of sat in the Yeah, past, he just he? kind of hung out. I got more work out of Mercury and uh, Vitriol. I'm a big fan of Mercury. I really like Mercury. Yeah, I think I think he's underrated. He's going to be very useful in this with the uh, yeah, throwing is. fire and throwing poison out. Uh, on the subject, throwing poison out, Calculus. Dishing blind out on this could be uh, could be very useful. Could be quite nasty. Um, and then obviously Mercury for his flame jet and fire blasts and set fire to all those wooden mannequins. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. <laughs> isn't it? Um, so 
story wise, Vecca, he's probably turn two, I imagine. He's got to have a big game. Pop, he's got to have a big yeah. game, hasn't he? He's got to come in early, hasn't he? Um, yeah, I, I think, I don't know, I like that we're, we're, we're doing this with cage ball. Wondering if, if we could have squeezed Venom in somewhere just as a. Added a little bit extra to it in a big. He's game. just on the well, sidelines though, Venom. Though in the story, he injects oh, cat and just kind of skulks away. Oh right, I, I thought uh, I thought he was involved. No, it's only these four that are, like literally named in the game. Ah well. We should say as well we've got guild plots. Uh, I drew Sikkim because obviously that's going to be needed with uh, yeah. this. But we've got no Gicks, so you might see the guild plots during Gicks. games. You might not Gicks. That's what the cool kids call. Gone, them. gone now, aren't they? Well, yeah, I don't know how what's going to happen with them. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, we're going to roll off and start this game. Paul just rolled a six off camera when he pre. You never pre roll, never pre roll. It's like that salt activation off first one of this season. Yeah. He's constantly rolling off camera, so I'm trying to get the bad balls out of the way. So, uh, oh, one. Oh, that's, not that's not good. That's not good. Oh, I knew it. Dear. Uh, the four and a six. Would you like to go first? Uh, would you like to kick or receive, mate? Um, with Midas, I will receive, please. Okay, so we'll go to the kick out and we'll be back in a sec. Okay, so we are going to start with my main man, Ballista. He's going to waddle five inches up to this position here. And basically, he's just going to try and punt it at that rock, Paul. So, slightly slightly that way a little bit. So, four dice kick. He screams it. Uh, so, green for direction. In the four, two inches. That's fine. That's going to clip. Clip the rock. Clip about there. Yeah, with that. Take the terrain with it. And we will go to the influence allocation for the first turn. And here's how things look at the start of the first turn. And Colossus isn't going to do much for me to start, Paul. I've got the, <laughs> the four on Ballista for a dead bolt and a minefield, I think. Uh, okay. Four on Velocity to chase the ball, maybe? I don't know. Uh, two on Salvo at the top. And that is it, really. I'm hoping that you've probably got to dangle someone to go and fetch the ball. And then maybe get the beat down on. I just feel Colossus is a little bit too far away. You've gone for an even spread, though. Yeah. Um, yeah. A bit of an yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, again, still not 100% sure on the Alchemist, but just had a quick read through the cards before the allocation. I'm going to hopefully get Mercury up to get the ball and throw out some fire and possibly pass back um, he may not be in range with a full pass but at least get the ball back within the vicinity of possibly Midas running up and grabbing it I think we can definitely say that Blister and Midas are not within our wheelhouse in terms of captains so no, but this is why we play these games uh, yeah definitely uh, Calculus maybe throw up some blind Blister at the moment is looking like the primary target for everything but <laughs> I think he's going to probably have activated before I get the fire magnet that is Blister yeah. so we'll see what happens I think uh, normal catalyst a bit scary on the smaller pitch because of his external combustion pushes yeah, pushing he could forward. chuck people around and we've realised that kind of Takeouts on the wings, Velocity is very close to the edge, and luckily she's <laughs> relatively safe, but anyone else who gets close to an edge... Yeah. Uh, ring out. Well, Catalyst has got a lot of pushes. Yes, he has. And I'll be perfectly honest, Colossus is looking like a nice target. Catalyst Four also starts on fire. He does, but that doesn't happen. Plus no. two tack. Plus two, yeah, he actually helps him, doesn't yeah. he? He's one of the best brawlers, I think, in the game, normal cat. Mm -hmm. Eight tack hefty ability to do damage six, with pushes. Six, oh, eight tackle. Right? Yeah. Yeah. So we will go to the first activation of the first turn with the alchemist seeing what they can do. Is there any general plan here? Chuck chuck all the chemicals. Vet. Just go for Vecca. Just, just, get, just get Vecca on the yeah. table. Right, here we go then. Okay, so my first activation, I'm going to go play pick up with Mercury. So we've just pre-measured this out. Uh, he's got an eight inch sprint, so I'm going to spend <laughs> one of his influence put them there so you can see me taking them away uh, I'm going to spend one of the four of allocated to him to sprint up gets him um, just to that proxy base yep yeah, gets him just to the proxy base there the ball is going to snap to him and then I'm going to spend one to pass back now I am out of range but this is more to in the direction of your team basically just get it near the team so he's got a pretty decent kick on him 4-6 um, he just, just gets just it just about gets it yeah um, so it's going to go back, but it will scatter. So green one is the direction. So the light green, you mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The, the yellowy green is the distance. The neon. The, the alchemist dice is the direction. So, so we got the one, two. One, two, yeah. So it is going to go 
that way. Bum, 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 bum. But basically in front of... It's the worst possible pass I could have done. Calculus. <laughs> uh, so we'll take them out of the way. Now, his last two influence. Uh, Blister's going to be in range of doing all of his character plays anyway. Um, so Mer uh, poor Mercury up there might just be a sitting duck. So I'm going to throw a flame jet. Just to annoy Salvo. Add Salvo, yeah. So you need uh, fours for this, mate, to hit. Fours for this. Oh, oh, you do. Just about. How many damage? So that is two damage and the burning condition. Which will slow me down, which yes. is not what I wanted because Salvo's got tether ball. I had dreams of just sprinting and nicking the ball. <laughs> uh, and that stays that AOA, doesn't it? Uh, it does, yes. Anyone entering or exiting. But what is it? Have you noticed the new AOEs don't stay as much anymore? I think Scarthas was the first to not, and now there's a Rat Catchers one that doesn't stay. And I think there's another one that doesn't stay. I'm not sure. Is the one in the. Blacksmiths? The one, there's one at a time, lads, but that does stay. It's Burnish's one with his three damage AoE, right. which also doesn't stay. I'll be honest, I've not noticed. <laughs> yeah, I think it's the way of things now. I think they're having some that uh, do more damage, but don't stay on pitch. It makes sense for the alchemists, kind of, to have them. That stay. The AoEs and those types of things, yeah, that, that stay, because it kind of suits their... It's the area the denial, isn't fluff. it? Yeah, see what, what tends to happen with games, and I've noticed it more and more with other games, and you see it, we've mentioned it about God here, is they focus too much on regular play and organised play and competitive play that the, the fluff goes out of it a little bit. You want bit. a thematic team. Yeah, and that the conditions and the, the AoEs for the Alchemists is very much... Well, Salvo's we beautiful hair is on fire. Yeah, I feel his pain. And his beautiful hair has got oh, a long time pink. No. Very nice. Not as good as Flint's hair that you painted. The Flint. stunning Flint quaffed hair. Oh yeah. That anyway. Is, that's my favourite Gilboa model. <laughs> so, nice and steady with Colossus. He needs to get the kind of machine whirring and getting into gear. So he's got a six inch base move. He's just going to stay. Just with an inch of cover there. And go back to you, mate. So, calculus for me. Um, with, Evil planning is afoot. Yeah, with the, with the thought of... Yeah, vet cat popping up a, at any moment. Um, I think getting the condition damage out is uh, is what needs to be done now. So calculus is going to simply walk up. She's going to ignore the ball. <laughs> so I don't want that ball. I've got poison to chuck. I'm playing guild ball without thinking about the ball. So the honest, goal scoring yeah, captain. I've put I've put a, I've put too much influence on Midas basically. Uh, <laughs> you can never put too much on Midas. Law of gold will always be there. Uh, yeah. You need a 3 plus against Ballista, mate. He's got tough hide, but nothing else that's going to help him much here. Yeah? Yep, so uh, Noxious Blast, um, 3 plus. Oh, 2-2s. Oh, two fails, 2-2s. Two so poison Cloud stays, though. But just no cloud poison stays. and no damage oh, to okay. me. Cool. Um, well, that is the end of her activation, unless she's got anything nifty. Ballista laughs at your concoctions. Yeah, that sucked. Over to you, buddy. Ballista's already tired of Mercury's... Uh, his, his doings, so he's going to make a five inch walk to there. So that is within an inch. I am immediately on fire though, because Mercury's so sexy. Sex is on fire. I'm going to wallop you in the face. I've never understood that song. Well, I don't know, it just sounds like someone's got like an STD yeah, to be honest. Yeah, you definitely need to go get checked out. So six dice, what am I rolling against Mercury? Uh, against Mercury, we've got fours with one armor. Oh, why do you hate me dice? Uh, one away is two hits. That is going to be a two-inch push. Oh, should have been rolling one less because of cover. Oh. So we'll call that one hit then, uh, which is one damage. One damage. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, which is no push. Yep. Uh, I'm going to hit again. So five tack. Make sure I actually roll the right amount of dice this time. Fours and one, please. Oh, nothing again. That's not good. Uh, so my plan of pushing Mercury off the pitch has immediately gone out the window. So, <laughs> Ballista is just going to try and deadbolt Calculus. Actually, no, because I'm going to lose a dice if I do that as well. Oh, it's all gone badly. It's all gone sadness. I'll tell you what, no, I'm going to swing at Mercury again. we will trust in my dice rolling. Famous last words. Uh, oh, we get it that time, so that's two hits. Uh, two inch push. No, I'm going to take just the momentous one inch push just because I actually want some momentum. So I'm just going to chuck him up here so he's still in cover. Swing once more. Oh, Ballista, you've messed up here. Uh, one away. Uh, two. 
is going to be a two inch push, I think, this time. Non momentous. So I'm going to chuck you out of the cover just to. There, mate. Which was not exactly what I was hoping for. I was hoping to kind of shuffle you along so Velocity could come and finish the job, but. So that was one damage in total. One damage and a little, little nudge. Big scary blister, not as scary as I thought. Yeah. So, plan I had for Midas has gone completely out the window. Um, so, I'm going to spend one of his two influence to sprint him to here, picking the ball up along the way. Plan B of going to score a goal next turn isn't exactly the worst <laughs> plan with Midas, to be honest. No, not at all. Um, and then I'm going to spend one momentum to make a pass with Midas. So I've got to keep checking my phone and I keep turning the app off. This is poor play. Because I forgot. We printed off the cards, but we can't remember where to put it. Um, oh, he's got a 3 8 kick, not 4. So 3 8 kick. Who are you kicking to? Uh, sorry, to Cat. The big guy with the grey hair, yeah. Catalyst. You're really angry about that hair. <laughs> <laughs> Success. Success. So you Very generate successful. A point of momentum. Do you generate one point of momentum. I like this map because you can keep tracking Yeah, momentum. you can put a little momentum on the edge. I'll remember to, that what I've got then. Do you want to dodge your effort? Um, no, I'm going to keep that momentum. Also, don't talk a big game about us remembering what momentum we've got because the amount of, If I had a penny for every time I annotated, like, Tom's lost a momentum, Paul's lost a momentum, <laughs> we'd be wealthy then. Yeah. Uh, so, back to me. Over to me, and poor Salvo is going to limp four inches just over these flames taking his fiery hairdo with him. He is going to spend two, and he is within four inches of blister, dum, dum, to dum. shoot uh, a... Oh, it makes no odds, but I'm going to shoot an arrow to the knee at Mercury. They both do uh, two damage. So two dice, looking for a four. Four you are. Nail it. So that is two damage to you, sir. I gain a point of momentum because of momentous inspiration. And because Salvo is a swift striker... He can dodge an inch further forward. I um, don't want to dodge into that uh, poison cloud. No, I, I've just dodged away from cover though, which is a bit silly. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to spend one of the momentum I gained to use uh, Locked and Loaded, which basically means Salvo can use the character play for free. So he's going to use Flurry for free okay. and try and shoot Mercury again. So two dice looking for a four. Get it. That's another two damage. Okay, Onto so that you. puts Mercury down to 10. And then I'm just going to dodge another inch. I still can't believe it took three seasons of Guild Ball for me to realise that the cards are, are intense. <laughs> and then I get a point of momentum, because again, I've been momentously inspired by Ballista and his gorgeous, fiery self. Um, I think I'm going to leave the fire damage, which I know I'm instantly going to regret when Vet Cat pops up soon. Dum, dum, dum. But for now, Vekat's poison, I think. No, it's anything, any status condition he's happy with. Chemical he gets plus one damage. Oh, yeah. Anyway, we'll go see what normal cat does in the meantime with the ball, footballing cat. Footballing cat. So, I'm going to try something. <laughs> You're going to try kick with Catalyst. You're going to try kick with Cat. Cat Catalyst to Midas. He's got a 2 6 kick. He does have. Easily within six. No, I can't do what we were going to talk about. I've only got two influence. Oh, oh. you were going to charge afterwards, weren't you? This was yeah. the plan. I'm going to pass. You could walk in and slap. Six inch move. Six. In yeah, I could do that. Yeah, that's all I will attempt to do. So, pass to Midas then. Pass to Midas. If this is successful, this could work. It's not. It's <laughs> not. Never mind. Um, so, scatter. I've got scatter here. You got one there. It's going directly towards Midas, six inches, well within range. A yellow one for direction, green one for distance. You swapped it now. Uh, Have three I? in the four. Three in the five. Three in five, is it? Yeah, it's oh, way. that's not the best, is it? Not an ideal situation. Mm -hmm. Then it'll centre on that point. Yep. This is what happens when Catalyst tries to play the foosballs. The foosballs. So that's one influence. You've got one left, though. Yeah, so it's just going to be running them off the pitch, then. Getting ready for the big transformation. Yeah. Is he just kind of screaming, then, do you think, at the moment? Because the poison is just starting to filter in. Is it's he just, like... It's just... You know what he's like? He's like... You can see like where he's kicking. the Ball supporters group. There's just... <laughs> just sheer nerdery emulating... Just 
<laughs> I cannot wait for this to go onto the channel in six months' time, Paul. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully, this is this. Obviously, when this goes on the main channel, we'll have redeemed ourselves. No, not only will we have redeemed ourselves. We don't need redeeming. We're excellent. We are awesome. You know that podcast where we said we're not egotistical. We totally are. Um, but hopefully, by then, somebody will have got a handle on the individuals that caused the the utmost nerd rage and hopefully by that time hopefully by the time people are seeing this video those individuals are well aware that they can kiss my ass and so concludes the most passive aggressive activation <laughs> we've ever recorded <laughs> back to the engineers um, oh yeah sorry Catalyst he's just going to get <laughs> you know what I'm going to get him dead centred the nerd rage is about to be released it's <laughs> Right, so Velocity is just going to have to try and churn some momentum, so she's going to spend one just to do an acrobatic dodge. She's then going to walk up to here, but her poor wooden bum is going to be set ablaze by Mercury in his sexiness, even in her, you know, undead style. She can't deny it, can she? She can't deny it. She can't say no to it. Mm -hmm. uh, she is going to have a swing, though. She wants the fight. Four dice plus one for Blister Knee being nearby. Fours and one. Uh, fours and one indeed. Yeah, that'll bad. do. Uh, that is... That's better than the uh, blister dump. Three hits. Um, oh. Momentous one damage, maybe? No, she hasn't even got a momentous damage. I'm going to go for the push dodge. The push dodge? Ooh. I'm going to push you ah. just into everybody. And I'm going to dodge just around here. Be very careful with Losty because she's the most fully over model in all of Guild Ball. Uh, yeah, I think she's literally just pissed she's that She's barely in. So I've got two pitch. mates now. Yeah. So I did get a uh, momentum for that, didn't I? Uh, I did, 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 yeah, did you? Yeah. So I'm going to swing again. Falls them on. Could you have dropped it? Drips and grabs then. <laughs> uh, two hits is another momentous push dodge. I'm just going to push you to the extremity of Blister. And I'm going to dodge just to there. And then <coughs> a final swing. The pitch at this room. I'm tempted to, that's what I was thinking about. Uh, go again, I actually rolled them this time. There we go. Three. Uh, one away. Uh, three hits, could be a momentous double dodge. Um, oh, how far away is Mercury from the edge of the pitch? Uh, about five. I reckon it's probably about, oh, actually no, it's less than five. Mm, yeah, no, 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 no. I'll take the momentous double dodge. And I'm just going to dodge two inches just into Skulk around the corner there. I'm terrified of Catalyst though, so I've got five momentum to your one. Yes. So you can still contest the roll off. Mm -hmm. uh, you need to roll a one, then you need to roll a six. Yeah, it's spending it to clear the fire damage. Um, yeah, I am going to spend one momentum. Just to heal velocity. So that leaves you down to four. Of her flumbadeness. Um, and that will conclude the turn. So, four momentum to one. Mm -hmm. So I'm on plus three advantage, mate. You've got rolling space just along this wing. Oh, two. Five. Five. Five goes up to six. Two goes up to six. It's a draw. It's a draw. Oh, yeah, sorry. Yeah, you got so four. So, roll again. Yeah, you six. Got six is a six. <laughs> but uh, I will go first because I'm terrified of Catalyst. Dun, Popping. Dun, dun. That's if he pops now. I if he pops, exactly. It? So um, we'll do the damage and we'll come back for the second turn. And that's just how things look at the start of the second turn. And I am very wary about that catalyst stood in the middle of the pitch, <laughs> winding up with a load of people on fire. So I was thinking about going Colossus to fetch the ball or to go in the middle and just do a big knockdown party on everyone. But in the interest of trying to do something a bit more clever and also just not actually gaining much out of that activation. Keep that cat off the board. Um, just to remind me. I think Salvo might go first. So he's got four, because I think I can actually use his tether ball, which is a rarely used play. Uh, but there is a line of sight between Midas and that cover to get to the ball. So he might be able to tether it and kick it over to Velocity, so she's got two. Ballista's got four if all else fails, so he can just dead bolt and do what Ballista does. Um, on the other hand of the pitch, though, mate, you've got... Four on Midas. So what's the rationale here? There's no rationale with having four on my It's, not it's just always that. good to have four yeah, on him, though. Um, he's probably in range to be able to score because he's my Because he's my I think he's got like a 16 inch threat range or something ridiculous. Catalyst has got two, so if he does transform, he's got max influence for Vet Cat. 
Yeah, I didn't even realise that because <laughs> he's got furious as well, hasn't he? Yeah, he's so nasty. having having that momentum for for this turn, and I've said this several times, and you've you've heard me say it several times, is that that's the best thing about Gilbert, the change that they made yeah. in season three, um, giving you that extra momentum. Uh, so having that means that if it do get knocked down, or it doesn't make a difference, we'll see. Um, obviously, we need to start getting some points on the on the board. And um, we've got effectively two footballing teams. I think so chaos is going to kick off this turn. I think something's going to happen, isn't it? So we we'll go to the engineers first for the first activation of turn two. Okay, so I'll explain the quandary here. It's uh, the order of activation. Get that freaking thing off the camera. Uh, it's the order of activation with Salvo, because Salvo's got locked and loaded, and what I want to do, as you can see, is tether the ball. Uh, but Salvo is on fire still, just underneath here. So it's about so when to use the actions, when to, <laughs> when to use the momentum, all this kind of stuff. So I am going to punch Mercury to start with. Oh, very nice. Uh, so. You're needing fours and one. Five dice with one for blister. I'm ideally looking for the double dodge here. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu, fives and one. That is... So basically I just want to dodge some on the extremity of melee range there. Okay. Swing again. So that was momentum for the double dodge. Uh, swing again, yeah. Falls one. Miss, 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 miss. One away. Uh, three hits is going to be a another momentous double dodge. And I'm just going to dodge just to that. Ooh, a bit too far. So, I need to be within six inches to use tether ball. I can limp my way over there, actually, can't I? Yeah. So, yeah. it's just fat cat, fat cat scares me. Um, so, yeah, I'm gonna walk with my limp to that position there, so just outside of an inch of catalyst. I'm gonna spend one of my momentum to put up locked and loaded. I still might he heal the fire though, to be honest, I'm not sure yet. And I'm gonna use tether ball for free. So target a free ball uh, within six inches, it's immediately placed in the possession of this model. Get over here. And I am, um, see staying in cat's range would have allowed me to swing at him, but oh, I don't know what to do here. <laughs> is the answer. Um, You're standing there, so that cat pops up. Are these within two? Instantly engaging. They are both within two. He's going to spend two to flurry. Oh no, but Midas, but Midas. Midas will just come and tackle me and score. I hate you, Midas. I hate everything you stand for. Midas might not tackle you. Can I draw a line of sight to velocity? Can you get my bird's eye view over here and see if we can draw a line of sight? You should be able to. We need to get base to base, don't we? Yeah, I'm within eight inches. Um, right, so there's your base. Yeah? Oh, well, did not the terrain, but I'll give that to you. Yeah. You're very kind. I so, am, aren't I? I will have to get it through Catalyst. You know how though. difficult this actually is right now, what I'm doing. Yeah. So I don't know. It's the hardest thing I've everywhere. Right, so I will be kicking it through Catalyst, though, so I will lose a dice. Okay. So that kind of evens things out. So I'm going to have a 2 8 kick okay. to try and get to velocity. Nail it. Nail it. Point of momentum. Moral victory has gone to me. Shut up. Away. Your catchphrase in recent like bar reps is always moral victory now. Um, and I sleep easy at night. No, because it's usually, <laughs> it's usually when you've done something you're like moral victory goes to Jay or moral victory goes to Tom. I suppose it's still being a gent, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. I'm nice like that. But uh, this is my moral victory for giving you that. I've got one left. You can't really do anything with one. So I am going to spend a momentum to heal that nasty burning condition away. And I've got one that's unspent that I'm sure if you go back in time, there's probably a better way of doing that, but I'm going to take it as is. So over to you, mate. Paul's literally just been like, give the people what they want. Yeah, yeah. so give the people what they want. So Nerd Rage Catalyst. What's he going to scream as he transforms? Damn you, veteran Captain Salta! <laughs> See the rage. Is he going to go Super Saiyan, basically? Gonna, that's why his hair colour changes? That's why his hair colour changes. Nailed it, there Super we go. Super Saiyan, that is it's it. Canon. Have you seen it? No, it's good apparently, Dragon Ball Super. It's amazing. With Bacchus, 
The cat god thing. Beerus. Beerus. Yeah. Did what? Jiren. It, we're getting off stuff. We'll come we'll on. It's a podcast for yeah, another yeah, time. That's, that's so you've got to nerd. put cat here with his bigger base. Yeah. So, so do you want to? Like, can you can you do something cool like on the special effects now? <laughs> there you go. That's the extent of my editing. Uh, boom. boom! The size difference. <laughs> just looking at the camera is immense. So he takes the one damage that normal cat had taken, which you've already marked off, Paul. Yeah. yeah. He so, is on fire still. He is on fire. But he's got two inch belly range. He's in anger. <laughs> Jesus Christ, poor Salvo. So yeah, it's like the story, though. Yeah. Nice, right? So what are you gonna do with this Thumb. beast? Um, big, you hit him. Big smash. You want to go for yeah. the push, really, don't you? Here, so you can get a charge off them. Attack. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Well, What's the dice? Yeah, yeah I've nicked one of them. Oh, yeah. Uh, so, eight tack, needing fours and one. Have you got somewhere to roll these? Uh, here ish. Okay. Fours and one, mate. <gasps> oh, that's, that's nothing! Right. I, nothing at all. I don't even want Oh my god, that was lucky. Jeez. That was one damage. Oh, Pathetic. big scary catalyst. Yeah, so that's cost me one influence. That's, that's, that's poor. That's anti class. It does put me on 10 health, though, if that helps. Yeah. Um, but your two inch melee range is helping out here, I suppose. Yeah, I'm gonna have to attack again. Roll those again, that was great. I'd rather not, actually. That's, That's better. Still That's still suck. It. It's better. Three. Minus one for the armor. Minus one, four. Two hits. Two hits. That's nice your push, though. That is the momentous push. Do I push him one inch back? Uh, yeah. Out of the way, Shoot. please. So you're still engaging me, but you can now freely charge into Colossus or. Ballista or Velocity. Uh, furious Sim. I suppose you didn't do Bobby Reed. Oh, that's someone else's channel. Furious. Yeah, anyway. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? That's Vet Cat. That's Vet Cat, yeah. Mediocre! All the Mad Max references now. <laughs> Still haven't seen that. Have you not seen it? You've lent me the DVD. Um, I've tried Did to I? Watch I it. didn't even remember that. Yeah, I've, that. You've, I've tried to watch it several times with Steph and she's not interested. You need to sit and watch it. It's I, a brilliant. I should off today while I was off, but it was pain. Subscribers and patrons, tell him he needs to watch it. I will watch Right, who are you going to charge? Uh, Ballista. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Just because he's there. Uh, you will get plus one for Mercury as well, so it's going to be a bucket of dice. Are you going into base to base? I don't know, I'm just going to engage him actually. Yeah, yeah I was going to say you got two inch melee. Two melee on it, yeah. yeah. God, how often do I play this game? So you've got eight dice base, plus four for the charge, plus one for Mercury, and you want plus one damage because Blister's on fire. Blister is on fire. This nerd rage is going to hurt. Uh, freeze them all, mate. I'm not going to take a defensive or anything because oh, what man, is the point? Three hits and I can get a one damage up to two damage intensify. There you go. Oh, man. Yeah, but the intensify does damage as well. Yeah, two, so that would be. Would Roll, that the well? Roll the dice. Roll the dice. Work it out. Freeze them. Oh, Jesus Christ. Ouch. That's, uh, that's many of the hits there. That is. That's a one full armor. playbook. Oh, no. Sorry, one there. So that is. Just one short of full playbook. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now oh, that's a full playbook. No, it's not he's got eight. Ooh. Uh, how many how many millions of damage am I taking, mate? It's whether to give you the damage or whether to knock you down and give you the damage because you're tough fired, haven't you? I have got tough fired. Um he hasn't got a knockdown though. No, he's, he has got a normal knockdown, but not mm. a momentous knockdown. There's three damage knockdown, which would go up to four, which would go back down. No, it's the three, three. damage. Yeah, but the, the knockdown is on eight hits. And oh, yes, yeah, seven. Sorry, yeah, You've got a three seven, damage yeah. intensifier you can access. That would go up to five, down to four, down to three. So it'd be three damage up to four, back down to three for the damage. And yeah. then it'll be. Intensifiers two. Yeah. Playbook damage results is chemical frenzy. It's nothing from the yeah. uh, character plays. So it'd be. Two damage down to one, and then it would be three damage that stays as three damage. Mm -hmm. So it'd be four. Or you could take the knockdown, or a double push. Yeah, I'll take the uh, the three damage intensify. Okay. So that's four damage in total, or three well, I believe so. This is us not using this much, but the three damage goes up by three one. Three damage goes up to four, play but down, down to three, yeah, because it's tough to three. But um, the intensify is... Two. 
two damage, but it go down to one, I think, because it's a fight. So I think it's a pulse. Nobody else is in range. No. So I think Ballista's on thirteen health by my reckoning there. Cool. I am. That's not bad though with this rage, and you've got the momentum there. Do you want to use it for anything? Um. Yeah, I will heal his burning condition. His burning condition. The <laughs> flames of his super saiyan have yeah. been dampened, have they? I'm going to take four damage anyway, aren't I? So rather than do that. Okay. Is that your activation done? That is... Yep. Yeah. That cat. That was a bit of a disappointing show, actually. He didn't take the first roll. To be fair, though, he's, he's still done a dent in Blister. Yeah, well, it's not hard, is it? <laughs> <laughs> we'll see what Blister yeah. can do next. Yeah, so that leaves me... So just... 24 health on Catalyst, uh, and I'm on two momentum. Over to the Ballista Man then, and uh, he is going to take a swing at Mercury. So his six attack will go down to five. Uh, yep. Needing fours and one. Mercury does not want to be hit, does he? One hit. One hit is going to be a measly single point of damage. That puts me down to nine. Uh, swing again. I am going to bonus time this, actually. <laughs> I kind of want to push him away. Never mind, Mercury. You are one damage. One damage, yep. Oh, no. Has Mercury got a knockdown? Mercury doesn't have a knockdown. Mercury doesn't have a knockdown. Okay. A, a single push and a double push on two and three. So you can't push me on a passing blow, so that's okay. So I'm going to take the not the. Oh, I'm going to move everything. I'm going to take the passing blow from Mercury. So attack plus three because one for catalyst and then two for the passing blow. It can't trigger any repositions, so it just has to be one of the damages. Threes and one, mate. That's not bad. At all, right? It's four, so that will be. Uh, May as well take the three down to one. Uh, three down to two. Puts me on eleven. It does yes. Uh, I am going to swing at Vet Cat now. Uh, twos and one. So six stack is back. Uh, twos and one. Twos and one. Yeah. One two three four five. One two three four five. Should have counted. Um, I'm going to put up the momentous minefield. Okay. So anyone entering uh, four inches of blister, uh, anyone starting in advance or entering this aura as part of an advance uh, suffers four damage. Okay. And then he's going to swing once more. Let's see if we can just get a knockdown here. Is that any enemies or anyone? Any me models. Ooh, so velocity could be enemy a models. No, oh, enemy, enemy. Sorry. Uh, two's and one. That's not great, but I think it's enough for the knockdown. Three. Take the two damage double push as well. I am going to take the momentous two damage with a two inch push. And I'm just going to shove you. Why doesn't Vet Catalyst not have like stoic or... Back there, so I'm okay there. Because that's what he's just a tough hard beast. Yeah, so that was two damage. Two yeah. damage, yes, mate. Puts me down to 22. And Blister's going to spend one of the momentum to heal four health. So he's back up to 15. Back to you, mate. Compose myself now after what did a, you just do, a little slip up. So I haven't got Midas's card with me, um, and I've got it up on my phone on whatever the app is. And you wanted to look at the back of the card. I wanted to look at the back of the card, so I take my phone away. <laughs> That's magic. Just, just add a moment. Um, right. right. Midas. So Midas. Midas has... Midas, Midas, he's our man. Forward influence on him, and I'm going to try something dead stupid now. I'm going to spend one momentum to make his heroic heroic dodge. The law of gold, not law of gold. What's um, it called? Promise of fortune. They're all to do with money now since yeah. I've changed this card. Um, let's make a two-inch dodge to there. Yes. Then I'm going to spend two influence to charge. Who are you charging? Colossus. Colossus. Come at me, bro. So let me just. This could backfire on me completely. <laughs> I've got an eight inch charge, two inch melee zone. Uh, one, one inch, inch melee zone. No, you've got, you've got a two inch kill. melee zone, so I'm trying to get to. Just to put me to there. Oh, you got pushed dodge on like two hits, haven't you? 
Go on then. So you're in cover, aren't you? Yes, so I am. Minus one dice. Twos and two. Oh, actually, I am going to counter attack because I've got stoic, haven't I? So I'm going to counter attack. Twos and two. You do have stoic, don't you? Yes. What the dick? Both Tom and Paul have only just realised this. Yep. Um, I'm, Hit probably, me. I'm probably going to get knocked down, aren't I? Hit me. This is genuinely going to suck. There's still five, though, when you're in cover yeah. when I counter attack you, so it's not easy. Um, no, oh man, this sucks. This really does suck. Um, so. So this is twos two. and two? Yeah, twos and two. Blooming so, almost everything hit though. Almost everything hit, which was good. And two way. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's a wrap. <laughs> yeah, so. So you could do the push dodge twice. Ignore the first one with the stoic, do it a second time. No, oh, six, seven hits, so it wouldn't get the, the full distance. Ah, uh, no. Yeah. Um, I could do the. You could still double dodge away, I suppose. One double dodge away. Or it could knock me down. I will do that actually. Sorry, I'm coaching from the sides here, but yeah. I'm trying to, I know you're not used to the cards. I will I will knock you down and deliver one damage. Have you got a knockdown token? No, uh, um, yes I have. Um, uh, uh, actually I'll one tough hide. Yeah, I'll one I'll one damage and uh, one in uh, one momentous dodge. So one damage and one inch dodge. One damage and one inch dodge. So I do get my counter attack then. No, if you knock down. So you've got a knock down one damage on it? No, sorry, no, knock down. Yeah. Ignore the one damage and the one in dodge. Did I just oh, okay. fumble so my words? You did. So you've done sorry. a non momentous knockdown. So non momentous knockdown. And then on the wrap, a momentous one inch dodge. Where okay. well, would you like to dodge to? Um, I will dodge two. Yeah. Yeah, stay within one. Okay. So I'm. you get an extra dice on these attacks now because I can't go below two defense? Yes. So, so you're on normal tack basically, the one you'd lose for cover, so you're on six. Six tack. Still twos and two. Twos and two, and with two influence left. You've got one momentum back, so you've got that already. Yeah, we've bought my start on that actually. Okay. You didn't ask me then? No, because I've got to keep track of your momentum. Uh, twos and two, so that was four hits, which is one, two, three, four. Um, that will be the one damage which you'll ignore. Um, push dodge. I'll ignore the push. Which you'll ignore the push. So and it will take the dodge. Momentous dodge, basically. Yeah. So for the one inch of that cover. So that's the momentum back there. Don't worry about it. Oh, yeah, yeah, two, sorry, yeah. And then you've got one influence left. One influence left. I'll buy another attack. Uh, so that's four. Three hits. Three hits. So I will do the momentous one damage and push dodge. Now you can push me where you like. Yes. So Midas is getting in within striking position. Basically, he's uh, he's on the hunt. Yeah, in essence, yeah. Um, gone the wrong way. Yeah, I went the wrong way with Midas. Got distracted by what I was doing. <laughs> Okay. Don't, don't feel like I've pushed you that far. I am going to do my next activation while we've got the camera here, because it's easy. Mm -hmm. Colossus is going to... Stand up. Stand up. Uh -oh. That's him done. So this will go back to the Alchemists. Okay, so I'm going to try something really stupid now. Um, Calculus is going to charge Colossus. Um, so I take four damage from... The minefield. The minefield. And I've already measured it well, then eight inches, so I'm just going to go base to base with them. Okay. Um, so that's cost me my two influence that I had on it, and the terrain everywhere. You'd lose one for cover, gain one for Midas, so yep. normal tack plus four. Yes, and I want to bonus to end this as well, just to give me an extra one. So that puts me down to two momentum. Um, just making sure I've got all the right... Trying to go for the wrap, do you wrap? Yep, so I need twos and two, aren't I? Yeah. Oh, there's a couple of ones oh, there. Oh, a few ones. Yeah. Two away. That's a full playbook, though. Full playbook. It's not a wrap, though. Yeah, so that will be two momentous damage we'll and to one. a push dodge. So you can still push me because the historic's being used. Yep. Are you going to dodge anywhere? 
I'm quite worried that suddenly the Alchemists are all in my half, so once I score this goal, there's a potential retaliation. I also realised I spent my last momentum with that counter-attack, so I need to somehow wing a momentum from somewhere. Mm -hmm. Over to um, Velocity. Yeah, Velocity is your last activation, isn't you? Right, I think my idiocy is kind of... Uh, I've got lucky here, I think. So, Velocity is going to move to that position there. Within an inch of Cat. She's going to have a swing at him. Dun, dun, dun. Four dice. Needing something decent. Twos and one. Oh, one away. Two, two so it's double dodge. It's not double dodge, it's a momentous push dodge. Oh, momentous push dodge. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to push you... Yeah, I'm going to push you into Ballista's melee range. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, actually no, I'm not, because I want to be... Yeah, so I'll still be engaging. Yeah, so I'm going to dodge forward. Let's do that first, so I'm just going to go to there. Can you sort velocity out for me, please, I mate? Can, yeah. So that should be the extremity of two inches. Uh, yeah. That's so in that case, I'll push you into salvo. Poor salvo. So that is a momentum, which I'll immediately spend with the last point of influence. Four dice kick. I get nervous now when I go for kicks on these Patreon ones because because Shark has burned me so many times. Uh, you so, do alright with velocity generally. Yeah, velocity is usually good. Famous last words. <laughs> oh, why? <laughs> This is supposed to be a nice, easy game to turn. Oh, God. How bad is it? It's, uh, we'll find out how bad it is. God. You know what, right? It's way. I really need this to prop, to, like, go. <laughs> to go flying. Yeah. Uh, in the five, five inches. That's a five, five inches. Quite so far back. That is, that is off the board, possibly. No, it's about an inch on, isn't it? Oh, no. The ball's very dead there. Go out at you. You can't generate momentum now, can you? No, I can, because it's got to be behind my line. Oh, right, okay. Oh, actually, I suppose if you centre it, I'll leave it to you, mate. You can call that off the edge, because it's any part of the ball. Oh, yeah. Damn. So that's off the edge. Scatter in the middle. Scatter. Dead. Well, it lands dead centre, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, it scatters from the centre, so I'm the active player. Do you want to roll these? We'll do. So, green for direction, red for distance, two, four. That is ideal for you. <laughs> Mad, it's way, isn't it? basically on calculus if you want to snap it. Chuck us oh, the ball. It's, it's the worrying thing is... You've got three momentum, and I've you've still got Mercury to go. Yeah, he hasn't got the range to be able to get over there. No, I mean, you're going to go first next turn, though. Not necessarily. You could, uh, you could win it. I've only got three momentum. Um, Do you want to snap it? Yeah, I'll snap it. I'll take it. Right, we'll go back to the Alchemist. You suck, Velocity. You, why can't Striker suck? That's so Heartbreak Hotel. At least it scattered back into the middle, though, otherwise that would be like three turns of fetching it. Well, no, I'd have just vet cat and everyone to just... <laughs> yeah, everyone be dead. I've just realised something with, with this cage ball and with this small alchemist team. They can deliver a lot of damage. They can, and if vet cat gets his witness me off and you put Salvo in the box permanently, Yeah. I'm going to be really screwed. <laughs> um, um, yeah, so Mercury... So, may as well just play the momentum race. I'm going to charge into Ballista. You're charging me? Yeah, yeah. Okay. May as well. You go base to base? Um, or an inch? I'll go with an inch out, please, mate. Okay. Uh, so, four attack basic. Minus one for the cover. Minus one for the cover and plus one. Uh, plus, plus four, four for, for the, the charge. charge. You have taken your four damage from the minefield. We've already marked it off. Yes. <coughs> um, so, threes, and threes one. with one. Do something for me here. Come on. Oh, oh Jesus. Sucked. Two, um, so I'm gonna have to go for the one damage and one inch push. The damage is ignored. Yeah, so just push me up the cover, please, mate. Yeah. So that is momentous, is it, mate? Yeah, that is momentous. So that puts me up to four. So you are on four. I'm on zero. So I'm on plus four. Four to five. Oh. It's a strong game. Ah, oh, no. Do you want to go first or second? I will go first, please, mate. Lovely, so we'll go, get ready for turn three. And it's the third turn, it's still nil-nil somehow. Yeah. Uh, you've somehow. got a tricky position here, mate, haven't you? Because you've got the ball within Costas' melee zone. Yep. So, and he's got Stoic. And he's got Stoic, close control, nasty counter-attacks. And he sucks. So you've got four on Midas and four on Calculus. Yep. Could pass away actual plus both, potentially. Yeah, that is that is an option, I suppose. Two on the beast. Two on... He wants um, to eat Salvo. Yeah, I want to do some damage. Uh, nothing on Mercury, because he's on the wrong wing. Yeah, basically. I've got three on Ballista in the middle. 
two on velocity just in case she wants to go for goal, two on salvo and then three on colossus just to see what this interaction is at the start of the turn. Yes. So we'll go to the alchemist for the first turn, first activation of turn three. So first activation for me is going to be Midas. Okay. And I'm going to take a couple of swings at the big man. Okay. Are you going to do anything in response? No. So minus one attack because of cover. Yep. So, so five dice. Five dice. Looking for um, twos with two. Twos with two. Oh, two ones. That's not good. So there's one net hit, which will be a momentous one inch dodge for me, which I will just go to there. Yep. So that's one away. Um, I will buy another attack, but I will bonus time this one. Okay. So up to your six. Up to me, six. Two's and one. Two, two's and two. Two's and two, sorry, yeah, I yeah. forgot about that. That's better. Four hits. Four hits. That will be, one, two, three, four. That will be a one damage push dodge. Okay, so I know the damage momentous. and the push. Yeah. Stoic. So I will go base to base with you. Um, I will buy another attack and I will bonus time that one as well. I'm going to counter attack on this one. Okay. Oh, oh three, three ones. One okay. hit. Yep, momentous dodge. Not nothing to do about that, unfortunately. Looks like I'm going to get thumped. So, counter attack, I am on five dice. Yep. Um, looking for fives on my dice? Uh, fives, yep. I get one. Um, I'm just going to chuck a single out. I'm okay. So that'd be the plus two attack when attacking afterwards. So I'll buy one more attack. One final swing. Uh, so you're on your bonus timing again. Yeah, I am bonus timing again. Okay. Two, three, four, five. Six attack then with the bonus time. Yeah, that's six. Two's and two. Two's and two. Hey, no, oh, you got one that time, but still. Yeah, so that is three. That will be the momentous one damage push dodge. So that you puts me can push one, me this time. One momentum and one inch widget. All this hard work is about to be undone, probably when <laughs> Colossus attacks next. Um, that is Midas's. Midas done. Are you dodging anywhere? Um, oh yeah, I've still got the freedom to be able to move, haven't I? A little bit of part and blow. Just tried to take my phone over. Well, no, you can dodge. You've got one inch dodge to play with, haven't oh, you? Yeah, so it's push dodge. Oh yeah, it was push dodge. So you could dodge, then move. Ah, I could do that, couldn't I? <laughs> I will... Dodge. dodge yourself forward. Uh, I think you should be... Yep, yeah, outside. So you've got a five inch base move to play with if you want me. Yeah, let's see if I can get myself on the tapping distance. <laughs> Just in case. Calculus, knock it over here. Yeah. Yeah, and it stops me from kind of abusing my single out on you then as well. Sort of. Sort of. <laughs> right, all sorted? Yep, yeah, over to you, mate. Over to me then. And Colossus is going to try and do something fancy. Famous last words. He's going to move himself just to this proxy base here. So he is engaging Calculus. He's got three influence, so he's going to spend one to have a swing at us. So his five tack will go down to four. What am I after against Calculus? Is she threes or fours? Uh, she is fours. I'm going to counter. With your one-inch melee? Oh no, not with my one-inch melee. I'm not going to do anything. Fours and one is nothing on that first attack. Yay. She might be okay, because I'm going to struggle to, to roll well here, to be honest. Oh, never mind. Uh, Famous last words. Uh, I'll take the momentous tackle. Just from her. Yep. Uh, I'm then going to spend my last one. I think. Oh, he's just out of range. I was thinking of the the snapshot opportunities. Um, I do want to keep the ball in play though, so I think I am going to have a kick. In the direction of velocity. Four dice. It is a success, barely. <laughs> and it's gonna go in the four, five inches. Pretty. Yeah, I'll go to it. Much over the top there. 
So I ain't getting momentum for it, but it means she's got it now, which means that cat's probably gonna suddenly be like, wooden lady with ball <laughs> needs to die. Uh, Red Captain Sword! Um, but no, not a bad showing for Colossus. He's kind of wrestled the ball back, so he's just going to hang out there, I think. Um, and chill. Okay, so the big man, Vet Catalyst, uh, is going to take a thump at Salvo. So, attack eight. Looking for fours and with one armor, yep. Yes, mate. Okay, so. <laughs> So this is going to be one of the influence. That was a two that just rolled off. Yeah, two that rolled off. Uh, so that oh, wasn't too bad wasn't actually. Bad at all. Three hits. Four hits, mate. You got Four six hits. there. Oh, I yeah. It's hiding on the alchemist yeah. token. Alchemist logo, alchemist token. So that will be a um, momentous double push. Okay. So I'm going to say. Chuck me out of the way and charge me by any chance. Yeah. Get to hell, noob. Me. Uh, and then I'm going to use Furious to charge Mercury. Uh, sorry, charge. Charge. He's just going to attack his this own guy. people. What's his name? Colossus. Colossus. So you got an eight inch charge range. I have, yeah. Beast, that cat. Absolute beast on the charge. Charge to here. Still be engaging. Yeah, you can't charge over the cover, so just be aware. You gotta take the the, yeah, that's the what thinnest path possible, really. You want to take, don't you? Oh yeah, I've got loads of room there. Okay, so you get your front of the base to that edge there. Mhm. Mm no, that's the back, mate. You're getting extra. Oh yeah, so you have to be like there. That's fine. Oh yeah. The big that's showdown. That is that is a big big showdown. So you've got eight tack. Eight tack. Minus one for the cover, but gain four for the charge. Yeah, so I just want to test something here. Done. <laughs> Not quite, but you can Not get a few quite. shoves. But you still got one influence after this anyway. I have, yeah. So I might not be able to do what I initially intended to do, but hopefully I can do something fun. So eight dice, minus one for the cover, and plus four for the charge. I'm going to bonus time this as well. So I am on two momentum, so it goes down to one. Um, so 12 dice. Yes. So this was furious. Twos and two, mate. Twos and two. Oh, it's only two ones. This is going to hurt. One, two, three, four. Oh, what is that? Is that That's eight? Eight. It's full playbook. Full playbook. Um, that will be three damage down to two. Yep. And a two inch push. I'm very glad that I'm just outside of four inches. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. <laughs> you still got another swing though. Yeah, um, another swing. So this will just be standard eight tack. Only eight tack. It's terrible that. Only eight. Uh, yep. That was a one. There's a few ones. Oh no, that's only three. Massive difference when you just miss a couple. Um, it's that two armour does actually make a difference. Yeah, one inch momentous push. <laughs> You're edging him over. Yeah. Edging him a bit by a bit. Well, Calculus has got the push dodges and she's got uh, what, a push on one? She has. And he is <laughs> just, just outside of one, but she could just go and chuck him off the pitch. That, that's uh, is that the plan? Partly the hope now, yeah. Oh, I pushed him so far; he's actually just falling off camera, so you actually <laughs> do you want to do a little spin? See the uh, a gentle pan. The distance he just is. Turn that. Oh, he dropped. Yeah, so you, that's how that's how close it is. Just over an inch. Just uh, yeah, just over an inch. Calculus is going to have to chuck him off the pitch. Calculus is going to have to chuck him off the pitch. Um, yep, so that's me done. Over to you. Right, over to Blister. He's going to turn around in absolute disgust at this flamethrower behind him. Uh, he's going to spend two... <laughs> dead Bolton. To dead Bolton in the face. No, he's not. Here he is. That's a five. That's three damage, good sir. Making it down to one. And I can push you two inches back, I think. But I've only got a three inch move. So, yeah, I'm gonna push you two inches back to there. 
And then I'm just going to... So you're outside of the cover. Yeah. So I'm just going to follow up within an inch. I gently spin the camera backwards just so the card doesn't overtake what's happening. Swing once more. So I've got six tack with Ballista. I also got Momentum actually for Momentous Inspiration. Because uh, I'm an inspiring bloke. I even inspire myself. Uh, six tack, fours and one. Oh yeah, he's... he's, he's a takeout? He's a toasted man. Uh, I'll take Momentous too. So that is a takeout. The first points on the board go to you. Mercury's gone. And I am going to simply spend a momentum just to heal myself for health. So I think I'm back up to 17. Back to you, mate. So Calculus is going to try and push that big chunk of metal off the board. Um, I'm going to charge base to base because I'm going to have to. Um, You're going to need a wrap here, aren't you? I am going to need a wrap, probably. I'm going to take a defensive stance. No, no, don't do that. To make it threes and two. Threes and two. So I'm on four attack basic. Yay. Um, plus four, plus one for that cat. Yes. Right range. Yeah. It's doable. It is doable. Um, threes and two. You've got two attacks after this anyway. Yep. Yeah. Threes and two. That wasn't too that bad. Wasn't bad at all. Two white. That was a two. Oh, that's a two as well. As well. So that's three. three. That is the push dodge. That is a two damage push dodge. Two, two damage push dodge. Momentous. Chucks the pen back. Yeah. So, so down to one damage for that. Yeah. So you are teetering on the edge now. You're on out of catalyst's range though. So you've got your base four attack here. Base four attack. Hold oh. on. Hold on, Colossus. So you got two swings at this, though. Yeah, you? that was momentous. Um, Are you going to bonus time, Paul? <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I waited for my opportunity. Though. I need one hit. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to bonus time. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck, mate. Two and two. So. Two and two. Oh, oh yeah. I yeah, got it. Got it. So you're just going to take non momentous push? Yeah. Uh, no, I'll take them. They've got two hits. I'll take the momentous push momentous and one push. damage. So you get two momentum there. One for the push, one for the takeout. Yep. Poor Colossus gets shoved off the pitch. It puts me up to four momentum. And two two in terms of the score. Yes. And that's Cat. That's uh, Cat. Calculus. She's got one left, but she can't do anything with it. Uh, she could throw a blind at somebody. Is it with an eight? Yeah, with an eight. She can blind yeah. Salvo if you want to have a roll yeah, with it. Yeah, may as well. Do you want to bonus time? No, I don't want a bonus time. Um, so, one dice. Nice. Fours. Looking for a four? Nope. No. <laughs> well, no. Rolled a lot of ones this game. I know. Righty um, then. Yeah, so that is me done. You've got Velocity and Salvo and left. And Salvo left to go. Velocity then is going to spend one just to put Nimble on herself. Not that there's any point. Uh, <laughs> Walt there, and she's going to redeem herself, Paul. I have an absolute faith. Ranges. One momentum spent, one influence. She's going to get a tap in with four dice. She only needs a three. She can't possibly mess it up. Oh, oh she nails it. Momentum back. That's four points on the board, which puts me on six. And potentially Salvo now could collect the rebound. So we're going to kick it out and we'll be back mm -hmm. in a second. Right, so a lot just happened there off camera. Yeah. <laughs> so you've played Who Are You? Yeah, we got these plot card things. We completely remembered. Yeah, well, uh, there's no point. We finally start learning how to use them and they're getting taken out of the game. You then booted it and it went somewhere near Ballista. Um, play so I play match fixing to make you re-roll it. It's now ended down here and we are on to Salvo's activation. So Salvo is going to sprint eight inches just to this position here to snap the ball no. for one. And he's going to spend his <laughs> other one to pass it to his sister or robo-sister. Uh, three dice, eight inch kick. Robo lover. Success. Gain a point of momentum. Are you going to try and snap shot this by? I am going to spend the momentum uh, that I've just gained. And Are you going to bonus that? That is the question, Paul. You've got <laughs> you've got four momentum. Are you going to bonus? So I am going to bonus time it just because points mean prizes. You've got two hits. Yeah. So I need two threes. Hey, velocity hey. redeems herself. So that is a momentum back for me. And I'm going to just spend it, Paul, because, you know, watch the world burn. Make so, that game. Is it a game? 
Yeah, it's first oh. ten. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Did not even realize. <laughs> you know when you've been playing like to 12 yeah. so much that it's like, where am I going to get my last two points from? Yeah. So I, was like, I was like, where, 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 where are you spending? Good game. I enjoy Cage Ball. We'll talk about it in the post match. I quite like this little. Take the mascots out of it in the future because yeah, damage and everything's Except correct. obviously. Veteran Captain Salt. Well, but he's not even mascot, a mascot, is he? He's, 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 he's leading the way. Anyway, we'll go to the post match. We'll see you in a second. Nerd Rage! Oh, I totally didn't realise I won that. <laughs> you know, at the start, when I was like, it's up to 10 points. Yeah. <laughs> it goes straight away. That time you can find pitches, well fun. Yeah, um, yeah, I like it. <laughs> well, that, yeah, no. Yeah, I, I, you didn't I like get what you ball. wanted out of that cat, though, did you? No, uh, the first dice roll let me down. Big, big, like, big up. The veteran captain Salt Rage has arrived on the field. Now when he popped up, though, he is an intimidating model. I know we, we everyone knows yeah. he's a big lump of metal, but he when is. you put normal cat who's big, yeah. and then the Hulk rocks up, it's like, oh, Salvo's going to get murdered. Yeah, um, well, we, we kind of threw the storyline out. We just. After yeah. the second turn, I don't think we had any points, did we? So it was just kind After of like... Velocity missed that goal. Yeah. She good girl redeemed herself though. Yeah, she the did. The snapshot to win the game. Won it without you realising it. Did it won it without me realising yeah. it. I, really, I, I thought I got more points than I actually did. I only got two points. I actually done nothing that game other than push Colossus off the pitch. Chucky people off the pitch with though. three <laughs> players. <laughs> it took me. And the thing is... Realistically though, like, that is realistic. This big machine that just like... <laughs> Trying to chuck it off. But Midas was like, I'll charge Midas over there. He's got them double pushes. Oh no, he's got Stoic. Oh, it's all right, I'll get him on the next people. one. And then I was like, oh, I can't reach that because he's got two. Do you think like Midas like got underneath and took all the gears out? Vetcat punched it to the edge and Calculus just went. No, not at all. I think, I think what happened, Midas went over there and went, oh, have you? I'm good. I'm, I'm not <laughs> I'm that good. I'm, I'm getting out of here. And that's, that's how I thought. And then. Vet cat. I want a vet cat to do a bit more. That minefield with ballista on a small pitch. Oh god. Mercury, four damage. Oh, <laughs> Boom. Okay. He was in a good place for it. He was in a good Everyone place. Everyone was activating and taking the damage. And not you would Did Vet Cat take? No, he Maybe wasn't. He, he wasn't have... no, he wasn't within, he was okay. Oh was he not? Yeah, yeah. But the uh, not using the breach oh. goal, that could be really potent in the cage ball scenario. Yeah. A ten inch goal with no intervention. Yeah. When he wants it. Mm -hmm. uh, just didn't play out. I was looking for it. That's why I was in the middle of the pitch, but yeah. it didn't quite work out. Um, but thoroughly enjoyed that. Not having the mascots, but instead having four players. Having the four players was nice. Yeah. Um, us think... recording it was really. We'll do a quick and dirty. We'll do a cage ball quick and yeah. dirty. Because us recording it, it was really chilled actually. Um, yeah, yeah. There was not. A lot everyone of, could do something. We always forget rules. <laughs> and when, dice we're play, and yeah, when we're playing the bigger games, it tends to be like we just. Like mechanical really focusing on what we've got to do with these with that cage ball game it was just quite let's get on with it I don't know Alchemist that well you've only played your engineers a few times yeah not and it was just stuff. like yeah let's just just do it and we've, we've, we've nice really one. recording wise this has been probably we've the most of fun we will definitely do another quick and dirty to if this does end up being short I'm not sure I'm should we do a bit. walk and dead for the quick and dirty yeah, you guys can tell us, I suppose. Yeah, yeah, let us know in the that. comment section if you want to see like a. Because we did a vote for when Jay was going to come and play, or yeah. what they wanted us to play as extra. I think it was Shades by and Cage Ball were at the top. Yeah, so cool. maybe we'll do one of those, then do Walk of Dead next yeah. month. Maybe we'll keep doing stuff. Mm -hmm. Anyway, speaking of next month, you're going to, you get to play a team that you know inside out. Yeah, uh, yeah except Hunters. Theron, though. New Theron. New Theron. Who you don't know inside out. Yeah, used yeah, new Theron once. But you've got, and quick and dirty, you've got like your old that. season two team that you still love. You've got Theron, Igrit, Jakar, the Bear, Zerola, and Fahad. Yeah. Um, actually, no, I don't think Zerola's mentioned. No, she is. is Zerola, she, yeah. I've, read, I've written the list. No, you wrote the list yeah. already. Yeah. She's referred to just the feral woman and her cat. Oh, and the cat. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. yes. The bear's definitely mentioned, which yeah. probably Chaska's not mentioned at all. That means Jakar's probably on yeah. them. Jaka no, Jakar's in it. Is he? So it's Theron, Bear, Jakar, Zerola, Fahad, Zerola, Fahad, Theron. Fahad Igret. Yeah. Theron. Theron. Fahad. Yep. Sorry, we're doing this on camera. Bear. Yep. Jakar, Zerola, Igret. Yeah, six. Oh, okay. oh no pain. No, uh, yes. no, because he's on the background, he's doing all the soliciting behind. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but they will be against the Mortician Scalpel led Morticians. Mm -hmm. Just as well, I bought that Mortician team before Christmas. <laughs> Very much so. Um, so I don't have to paint it. No, but that will be basically seen if, ca if Gast dies. So even though in this one our stipulation was really simple in terms yeah, of just that cat, and it wasn't, wasn't really much surprise when he rocked up, it was just no. death. This one, if the bear takes out Gast, Paul wins. Game. Yes. 
Um, so the, the mortician's going to have to pull every trick in the book to stop that from happening. Oh, you get to use Arbalus? No, I don't. I've got Scalpel. Oh, Scalpel. the voodoo oh, strings yes. that. But in the story, Obulus tells her not to. Yeah. But I don't think I, I can't deliberately throw the game. So it's going to be a case if you can take Gast out of the bear, game. Yeah. Now, Gast is a pain to take out because of rising anger and fear and all that stuff. Fear the bear the charges the bear. for free. Now they've just got that push, especially yeah. if it was getting the follow on turn. I think it's going to be a GTF beast. noob. And that's his first kind of uh, scalp, and then he's on to Honor and the next one. My poor Masons, that would be a good game. On my Me with my Honor Masons versus you with your Hunters with Theron. Yeah. That's going to be a hell of a game. Must be really good with Theron. So, <laughs> he's big enough now, he's just played it down key. And that's, our, that's our season two final. There's only three games. Yeah. And then we're on to Fresh rewrite, rewrite, rewrite this history. All the way. No, no, no. no. Uh, which is going to be really... Can we get somebody else in to do that? I hate... Well, we could get Jay, but that didn't work. I hate out. Thresher Farmers, and I was about to say something then, but I know I can't. You can't say it. No. Everyone knows exactly where that's going, yeah. but uh, they might not be as good. Uh, so, <laughs> <laughs> spoilers. We saw nothing. Um, so, anyway, guys, we hope you enjoyed this. Yes. And again, sorry this came out at the same time as the podcast, but we hope you loved it. Yeah, we were the busy one. Very sorry. Yeah, oh my God. But we are going to get on it straight away with the recording for the next one, and we'll be back with a quick and dirty for you. So, take care. Hi guys, thank you very much for watching our content, it means the world to us. If you'd like to see some more videos, they should be over here. And if you'd like to support our channel, keep these lights on. You can find links to our Patreon and merchandise in the description below. See you later.